Digjoxin. Digjoxin is a second-line medication given to treat heart failure and atrial fibrillation. It has a positive inotropic effect, which means it increases the force of myocardial contraction. And it has a negative chronotropic effect, which means it slows the heart rate. By increasing myocardial contraction, DSG increases cardiac output and improves circulation and tissue perfusion. It also decreases preload and fluid retention. Dietschi has a narrow therapeutic range of 0.5 to 2.0 nanograms per milliliter. A level of more than 2.0 can result in Dietschi toxicity. Dietschi toxicity can cause bradycardia and heart block. It is important to recognize signs of toxicity. Early signs are GI-related such as nausea, anorexia, and abdominal pain. Other signs include dizziness, alteration in color vision, scotomas, and neurological symptoms such as fatigue and confusion. Nursing interventions. DITCHG is excreted by the kidney, so monitor creatinine and BUN, because any kidney injury can cause accumulation of DITCHG. Monitor for hypercalcemia, hypokalemia, and hypomagnesemia, which can increase risk of DITCHG toxicity. Hypokalemia can lead to DITCHG toxicity because DITCHG works by binding to sodium-potassium pumps on the same site as potassium. When potassium level is low, there is less competition, and DICHI can easily bind to the pumps and lead to DICHI toxicity. Some medications can interfere with DICHI absorption. Amiodarone increases DICHI toxicity, and antacids interfere with absorption of DICHI and lowers its therapeutic level.